still waiting for this pink to casually fade out. I don't know if it's gonna go. Today I'm going to be doing a, another productive day in the life of an online college student because you guys seem to really like my first one and it motivated you to be productive. I'm going to be doing another one of those today. It's 9-11 in the morning. I woke up this morning around 7.30, laid in bed until like 8, 15, not gonna lie. And then I got myself up, I made my bed. That's the number one thing I do every single day. I had a few Depop orders that I needed to go take to the post office, so I dropped those off right when they opened. We have our little to-go coffee from one of my favorite local coffee shops. Always support local guys when you can. So I got a latte because we are also out of coffee pods. So I have a few things I wanna get done today. I'm gonna start by writing out my to-do list. I'm gonna be showing you guys my skincare routine, me working out today, taking my dog on a walk. We are going to do lots of online lecture notes because I have some of those to do. Then I'm gonna show you guys a little bit of an insight on what I do behind the scenes for YouTube work. It's gonna be a good day. We're gonna be productive. Got my water, I already chugged one of these because it's the first thing I do always in the morning. I always get one of these big waters and I put half a lemon and I chug that down before I allow myself to have anything else. It always makes you feel better too. I wanted to show you guys the easy two-step skincare routine and I genuinely have been loving this because of how easy and simple and quick that this routine is. I wanted to say thank you to Medicube for sponsoring today's video. If you guys don't know what Medicube is, it is a Korean beauty and skincare company. Let me tell you, I was so impressed. Their products have done my skin wonders. The first thing that I do during my skincare routine is take my Medicube Zero Pore Pads and these things are amazing. I take one pad and then I go in circular motions around my skin. There's ingredient in these pads that soothes and moisturizes the skin. It's called Centella Asiatica, I think. I'm gonna put it right here on the screen because I don't want to butcher the name. It enables your makeup to be applied a lot smoother and it will last a lot longer. Within this one step, these pads exfoliate, cleanse your pores, and moisturizes all at the same time. The Zero Pore Pads contain BHA that cleanses out your pores and controls excessive sebum. It also contains AHA which helps exfoliate the skin to reveal smoother and softer skin. This is what the pore pad looks like. I usually take the textured side and I will go over that on my whole face and then after I'll take the silky side go over my face one more time just so I can get the max amount of product on my skin. It does so many different things all at once and that saves you so much time and so much money. Instead of buying like three separate products, you all have it here in one. My skin after I do this feels super clean, tight, moisturized. Second step that I do for my skincare routine is use the Super Sika Ampoule and this stuff is so amazing. The Dermaclara in this product helps strengthen the skin barrier and provides long lasting soothing effects. Another thing that's super important to me is hypoallergenic ingredients and that is what this product has. And and it has a natural cooling effect, which is super nice after you apply it. So this product heals damaged skin and soothes irritated skin. It's effective for relieving redness, which you guys know that is something that I deal with. My skin is not perfect. I'm very fortunate to have pretty clear skin, but it's not always been like this. I have dealt with breakouts in the past and finding a good skincare routine is very important to me. I love how natural these products are. You twist the cap and it automatically pulls the product into the little tube. And I just put one drop onto each cheek. 
Every day I put this stuff on and the next day I wake up and my skin is still glowing. That is it for my two-step skincare routine. If you guys are interested in any of these products, I will leave all of the information in the description box below and the direct links so you guys can purchase them as well as a coupon code if you guys are interested. So I will leave that on the screen and in the description box below. Thank you Medicube for sponsoring this part of the video. Tuesdays and Thursdays, which today is a Tuesday, I only have one class if I were to be at school. So that's the day that I do the lecture online. So I already did that. I'm glad I got that out of the way. Anything else that I need to do tonight is just like homework. I do have tutoring tonight, so we'll do that all later. But I'm glad I got like the main lectures and stuff out of the way. It's 10.08 right now, so before it gets too hot, because I don't like to take my puppy out during the middle of the day, because that's just too hot for him. I'm going to go take this one. You, mister. You ready? Hey, buddy. I think he likes my skincare. You want to go on a walk? You want to go on a walk? Walk? <laughs> All right, Bubby. Are you ready to go on a walk, mister? You pretty boy. Shoes on. I love these because I literally can just slip them on, not have to worry about anything. Woo, okay. Come on this way. I'm gonna go this way. I get so excited. <laughs> Come on, let's go. Let's go. So I just took my puppy on a walk. That was a good little walk. It's so pretty out right now. It's like 1030 and it's just like starting to get really warm for the day. It's supposed to be like 72 today. So I know the UV is going to be pretty high. I think I'm going to try and get outside to like lay out there by like 1130, 12 and then lay out there for like an hour or an hour and a half because it's so nice today. I might as well get some sun. In the meantime, I'm going to go downstairs and make some breakfast because it's 1030. I'm really hungry. <laughs> Currently making avocado toast on a bagel. I have my little guacamole mix. I usually get an avocado and then put garlic powder, salt, pepper, cayenne, and then put that on top of my bagel. Sorry. It's really, really nice outside today. It's 11 o'clock, so I'm sitting outside because I like sitting out here when it's pretty. We're stuck inside all day. Gotta get as much vitamin C. Vitamin D? Vitamin C? I don't know. Gotta get as much sunlight and fresh air as you can. So I'm sitting out here eating my avocado toast. You guys know. I mean, I don't know if you know, but I love spicy food. Like, I am a sucker for spicy food. So the cayenne pepper was not enough for me, so I put sriracha on. Every single time I come downstairs, he thinks it's time to go on a walk. I already took him. Anyways, I'm actually sitting right here and editing. Change of scenery. You know what? I like sitting in here. It's really comfy. I have myself all bundled up. Editing time we go. <laughs> all right so it is time to work out it's about two o'clock now and it feels really good because it's kind of overcast but a little bit warm today i'm doing day 10 of chloe tang ab workout i'm very excited i am very close to being done with this Okay, I'll get back to you when I finish this. Hi. It's 2.55 now and I just finished my like workout for today. So I'm going to the park right now to meet one of my friends so we can go running back there. All right, so I just worked out and I'm just trying to shower on. Try and get more of this pink out of my hair. And I'll see you after. I just got out of the shower. That was a good shower. I did a little treatment in the hair mask on my hair because obviously I'm trying to get the pink out like the least damaging way that I can. So I make sure to really moisturize my hair and make sure it's like not being so dried out because I want to be careful with it. If you guys have any tips on how to get pink hair dye out of blonde hair, naturally blonde hair, please let me know down below because obviously I can't like go get that fixed right now. I'm kind of over the pink, not gonna lie. It was such a spontaneous thing. It's cool in the moment, but like now I'm just kind of regretting that I did that to my hair because I'm like, Maya, you have naturally blonde hair. Why did you ruin that? So many people want blonde hair and I just, mm, I don't know what I did. So now I have my pajamas on. I'm really hungry because I haven't had anything all day except for coffee and then the avocado toast. About five o'clock now and I have my tutoring session soon. So I'm gonna go downstairs. And over this quarantine, my family, we've made homemade sushi, which was so much fun to make. I really liked it, it turned out good. We have been 
making poke bowls and we have been loving them. So we do do like the rice, either white or brown rice, and then avocado, masiago, which is like the little tiny fish eggs. We have the seaweed I'm really excited about. We also put like mango or pineapple in it, which is really good. And then if you want it like sweet and spicy, you add some like sriracha and there you go. It is so good. And like edamame if you want, cucumber. My family has been obsessed with making that recently. I think we are having that tonight for dinner. I think I'm gonna end the vlog off here. I really hope you guys enjoyed this video. Thank you guys so much for watching. If you guys want more of these days in my life of an online college student, then I will definitely do them for you. Also, if you guys wanna check out Metacube, I will leave all that information down below as well. Again, if you guys wanna check them out. Thank you Metacube for sponsoring. I love you guys and I will see you very soon in my next video. Bye guys.